Hello, today we'll be talking about SDG 6, which is clean water and sanitation, but in specific, we will be talking about how can we place measures to combat this issue of untreated wastewater into our waterways. Guys, before learning more about this issue and this SDG, I would like to introduce myself. My name is Sarah Diab, and I'm going to be your deputy chair for this committee. I've started MUN about a year ago, and ever since I've been to multiple MUN conferences, and I enjoy it. I would also like to add on that I'm extremely proud of you guys for starting this young. You all deserve a round of applause. And feel free anytime to contact me if you face any problems or want assistance in general. Thank you. Water is a central for the human body and any living thing. And untreated wastewater into our waterways affects 1.8 billion people worldwide, which is 25% of the world's population lacking treated water. The amount of untreated wastewater into our waterways keeps increasing each year, thus causing more deaths on our marine and human life. SDG 6 aims to ensure access to water and sanitation for all, while substantial progress has been made in increasing access to clean water and sanitation, billions of people, mostly in rural areas, still lack this basic service. Here are a few examples of how people live with untreated wastewater into waterways, then follow a long journey with Chiru, who has no option but to consume and sanitize water each day. Industrial activities, leaking sewer, litter, poorly controlled waste sites, and illegal dumping. And this is not all, as every year new environmental issues affecting our waterways are risen to concern. Although many of these causes are illegal, like poorly controlled waste sites, millions of companies and individuals fail to follow this simple law. stated that eliminating this issue is quite possible if done correctly so why not change things now why not eliminate this problem thank you